Hi, welcome to Hexus TV. My name is Andrew, and this is the well, not this. This is the Tufel 5.1 uh, Magnum Concept uh, Power Edition. It's a 5.1 surround sound speaker system, including a meaty subwoofer uh, made by Tufel or Tefel or Tefel. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. It's spelled T-E-U-F-E-L, so you decide. Um, but it's a very, very, very high-end but low price speaker system. It's not too showy, it's very, very practical looking, but you don't want to get all caught up with you know, flash and design when you just want pure raw sound to support your gaming and your movie watching, right? So the box will fit in the corner, the subwoofer will be under the stairs somewhere, you can throw your speakers around the room and voila. Now, questions, which all boil down to the same question at the end of the day. How much is it? Whether you can afford to buy it, whether you can walk into a shop right now and go, yeah, I'm gonna buy that speaker set, or whether you will just look at it longingly from afar in a window with this sort of glazed, remorseful look in your eye because you can never afford it and <laughs> never will. There are, there are 160, by the way, uh, or 139 on uh, some sort of website, uh, which is another word for a type of jungle. Um, which is a really, really good price, actually, for what they are. And, and you know, the, the f from the weight of them, when the bots come in, I mean, they're heavy. You know that scene in uh, Jurassic Park where the kid picks up the goggles from under the, under the chair and the guy's like, uh, are they heavy? And the kid's like, yeah. He goes, then they're expensive, put them down. This was expensive. We put it down. And then we opened it and then we played with it and it's amazing. Uh, really, really, really hardcore channeling. I mean, the sort of... <sighs> The low end frequency response is just insane, like ripples of bass that you can feel coming through your skeleton like insane. Uh, so that's always a good thing. And then for the high end frequencies and, and for the, the pitching and from what we saw watching, you know, like uh, Die Hard. <laughs> So what else is there that we can weigh this up against? You've got the Logitech, the Z5500, which is a digital 5.1 surround sound system. Uh, same deal, subwoofer, speakers, tweeters, rears, fronts, and all that, but slightly higher end, 200 pounds, and also it has a digital decoder in it, which is fine. This doesn't have a digital decoder, but at the same point, it's still got a much, much better uh, bass, residual, and low frequency response on it. Uh, you're, you're, you really are paying for the quality of sound and the output on this as opposed to anything fancy. So what does it sound like? Whip pan. You are authorized to engage and destroy. So all in all, it's a good price, it's a good system, it's a relatively good size, it kicks out a mean sound and, you know, compared to the rest of the market, your Panasonic's, your Sony's, your Logitech's more PC based or whatever, you're getting good value for money across the board. It's an excellent sounding 5.1 surround sound speaker system and it's German. <laughs>